Today we take a look at my Halloween display, including my new haunted house, my huge hidden side school, my Scooby-Doo mansion, and my massive Monster Fighters castle. Welcome back to my channel everyone, and today we have a spooky spectacular, my Halloween display for 2023. I decided to pick four of my favourite frightening designs and make a spooky street. We've got possessed teachers and pupils at the school, a ghost story mystery for Shaggy and Scooby, a new home for my zombie family, and Lord Vampire is back, he's up to his usual tricks. If you want more information about any of these builds, link videos for each part are included in the description below. Today I will go through the display, picking out some demonic details for you all, and hopefully it will give you some inspiration for epic builds this Halloween. There's loads more exciting stuff coming up this year, so please click the like button and subscribe for more LEGO content and free instructions. So here's my display in its entirety, and we're going to go through it from left to right. Now we start off with my hidden side haunted high school, made from two sets combined. It opens like a doll's house, with a layout over three levels. A hugely underrated LEGO theme, I was quite fond of the hidden side, and I think the school was the best of the first wave. In this model there are loads of haunted features inside, and at the front you can see teachers and pupils who are possessed, and Jack and Parker have been sent round to sort it out. Next we have a ghost story mystery, inspired by the Lego Scooby-Doo range. This modular mansion is fully loaded with a packed interior, but today we focus on the exterior details. The building is looking a little unkempt, with weeds growing up it, and there are ghosts coming out of the walls. The glow-in-the-dark ghost element remains one of my favourite pieces of all time. Did I mention the mansion has man-eating plants growing outside? Next up we have my new haunted house. I did a full instruction video last week, so you can make it yourself if you own the Lego haunted house from the fairground range. You can see that my zombie family have moved in, along with some ghostly friends that occupy the top floor and the roof. I put in lots of extras in the surrounding garden area, including a dead tree, which seems to have been inhabited by a vicious looking werewolf. Finally, here is my castle that started off my channel. I made an enormous design for Lord Vampire and his other half to live, including a moat with fully functioning drawbridge entrance. Now of course Lord Vampire is not going to have it all his own way, and Sir Rodney Rathbone has turned up to check it out. Lord Vampire is not too happy to see him, and I guess these two are about to engage in their battle over the Moonstones again. So that's it, my Halloween display for 2023. Now go and make something epic out of your own collection. Many thanks for watching.